Hi there, my name's Neela Betridge, and in this video, I'm going to be introducing the concept behind procrastination. What are the themes that lie behind procrastination? Well, there are a number. The first one is avoidance. We avoid things so that we don't feel any discomfort. The other theme is about restoring balance. Sometimes we are under the false illusion that by procrastinating, we restore the balance. It may also be an interpersonal thing about others taking over that makes us procrastinate. And for many of us, and I know I can be one of them, overcommitment makes us procrastinate. So where in your life are you overcommitted? Are you overpromising and not using that wonderful word no often enough? So there are different types of procrastinators and I want you to, as I say them, recognize yourself in one or two of them. There is the overdoer. Many of us fall into that category. There is the dreamer, constantly dreaming, but actually not doing any of the doing. There is the perfectionist, the 120% person, when 80% would do just fine. There is the eternal warrior that stops themselves from actually moving forward. There is also the definer, having to be very defined about what you need to do. And then there is the crisis maker. These are all types of procrastinators. Recognize yourself in any one of those themes? What prevents you from getting on with the activities that you need to do now? Maybe list some of those activities that you have been procrastinating about over the last month or so. And I want you on a piece of paper to think about two things by topic. What are the thoughts that are impeding your actions as you think about this action? And what are the thoughts that are promoting your actions? And do a really full list by the thing that you are actually procrastinating over. And then just get started. Have some first steps, keep going, don't skip back. And the golden rule of procrastination is just do it and do it now. Hold yourself to account. I wish you well.